Hey guys, BX Bricks back with another LEGO Transformer review, and today we have something pretty special. I was gonna do this whole intro where I try to make my voice sound like Optimus and come in with this whole description of what this is about right here, but um, yeah, it's pretty late in the day and in the month, and I'm pretty surprised that it took me this long enough to come up with this. But um, essentially, um, there is like a secret society of all the best Lego Transformer builders, and we call it the Well of All Sparks. Now it's not really secret, but um, it's, it is pretty cool. Um, we came up with this challenge for the month of March. It's called uh, the All Spark Assembly Challenge. And this month, all of us are doing uh, DeLoreans, DeLorean Transformers. So I'm gonna put links in my description down below down below of everybody who was participating in the challenge so definitely go check out their videos um shout out to kw lego formers because he is the one that kind of gelled the whole idea of the delorean transformer and we all graciously accepted and here is mine um also shout out to mindbender because he had the idea of hey why don't you incorporate um marty mcfly's girlfriend's name into the transformer because i wanted to kind of make mine a fembot so um he said uh you know put jennifer in there somewhere so i decided to come up with generator let's check it out all right here we have generator who is uh a fembot and a lego transformer delorean from back to the future i think it came out pretty dope it's a heavily modified um build of my v3 uh bumblebee made to look like a delorean so i think that came out pretty nice um see nice little boosters in the back i kind of paid attention with detail because it's like four slots per booster thing and yeah all that good stuff right there so let's get into uh i guess articulation in vehicle mode um it does not roll extremely well i guess you have to have like all the wheels lined up appropriately and it's just like just because of the whole gimmick that i'm about to show off where the wheels fold under so let's get into that well first i want to kind of open the doors because it looks better with the wheels down i guess so i did put, oh no oh no <laughs> i did make sure that i put the same type of doors on a delorean on both sides. There you go. So you can kind of see the guts of the car at that point. But it's not too bad. I mean, you just kind of see the forearm and the leg and stuff. But just to give you guys an idea of how that looked and came out. And then, of course, the wheels which do go down using some awesome robot arms. Guess I should kind of zoom out a little bit for you guys, right? And then pull this out a little bit and that folds down to the bottom. And this will go down to the bottom as well. Just do it. Pull it out a little bit, and then it'll fall down. And there is the car in like hover mode right there. Kind of set that down. Good. Close up on that. Looks very good. Super dupe. So, with all that being said, we are going to get into transformation. Yes. So, let me zoom out a little bit. So, the first thing we're going to do is detach this piece right here. Right? Make sure you guys can see. And this will be used later for like maybe a weapon or something. Kind of stole one of the pieces with it, just to 
little bit. There you go. So, fold down the waist right here, kind of split the, the wheels right there. Zoom out a little bit more so you guys can see everything. And then rotate at the waist. Like so. And then we're going to rotate at the thigh or at the hip. And then again at the knee. Like so. Do the same on the other side. Rotate at the hip, then rotate at the knee. Like that. And we're pretty much done with the legs at that point. Very nice. So the next thing we're going to do is get these wheels down on both sides and then begin rotating the arms out. Like so. And then rotate at the shoulder. Uh, it's so tight. Very good, very good. And then rotate the little arm piece up here. And then you have one arm done. Do the same on the other side. And rotate at the shoulder. Rotate. Oh, the looks like that mixel ball joint didn't want to come out. It's so tight. There you go. Now you can rotate it. Make sure everything is nice and tight there. And then you could kind of just fold that part up. And there you have two arms done. All right, the next thing we're gonna do right here is lift up the whole windshield piece so we could get this little flap and fold that to the back. And then that'll allow us access to get to the head. And just flip that up like so. And then fold everything down on its back. Get her nice and standing straight. Nice. Let's get a little zoomy zoomy action. Nice. Now let's get her a little, um, well, we do have a little community weapon right here. A little traditional um, transformer gun that I designed. Then you can kind of have her aim and shoot a little bit. She does have rotation at the neck for like on a Robot arm, I think that looks pretty good. I think that looks pretty good. Let's kind of zoom in a little bit. There we go. Let's do a final spin. Let's get to center stage first, center stage. Let's take a look at generator. Nice. I like how the wheels fold up in the back in there. I mean, they're kind of covered anyway by the, the wheel well, but I think it slims down the, the leg profile a little bit. So just to do a size comparison, I love to show off uh, new characters that I have. So I'm not sure if I show this one off yet, but we do have Groove from my protector bots. And they will be making a debut at a Philly Brickfest next month. Um, so if you want to come by, check me out. I will be there, all right? But Deluxe Scale DeLorean, just like the same as my other LEGO Transformers, so I like to stay constant, I mean, you know, keep the consistency going with that. So roughly about the same size as my Bumblebee. Very nice, very nice. So this is BX Bricks thanking you guys once again for liking, subscribing, sharing, and commenting. Once again, this is part of the 
all spark assembly challenge so make sure that you check out all of the links that i put down below to see the other guys videos and you know get an idea of where they were going with the delorean transformer um i'm pretty sure we might be coming up with another challenge for april if not then definitely by may so stay tuned for that we're going to try to create a hashtag and um i'll probably put it put that also down in the description below and um unfortunately i won't be releasing any instructions for this for um for generator right here um so she won't be in the mainstream of my lego transformer so it's all about this video and um sharing the awesome idea from the well of all sparks so um definitely stay tuned for our next challenge and i will see you guys next time peace